Charge of integration in the Central African sub-region have identified the existence of several economic blocks as a deterrent to the development of the sub-region. The ministers who began meeting in Yaoundé for their second steering uh, committee want to restructure the two sub-regional economic communities. The meeting was chaired by Cameroon's Minister of the Economy, Planning and Regional Development, Emmanuel Nganun Jumesi, as we see in the following report by Luma Slims Davis. The Central Africa sub-region is endowed with potentials that could spur meaningful development for general benefit. However, while some countries make relative progress, others are slow in their development process. To put all countries on the rails of sound development and economic growth, the restructuring of regional economic communities in Central Africa is necessary. The expectations is, should be just uh, summarized in one point, to have the rationalization process between CEMAC and ECAS moving forward. Twelve priority areas for harmonization in order to achieve the target objective are free circulation of goods and persons, energy, security, trade and transport. Others are information technology and communication as well as budgetary and monetary rules amongst others. Decisions of this second steering committee meeting for the restructuring of regional economic communities of the sub-region will certainly bridge the gap in harmonizing policies, programs and integration instruments of the Central Africa Economic and Monetary Community and the Economic Community for Central African States.